Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, Microsoft made an announcement in the last few days that it was releasing 25H2 uh, as pretty much a general availability which means any machine that is compatible will get 25H2 and this includes um, of course um, compatibility with the hardware so if you are on 24H2 and um, you are unsupported of course you won't see it you'll have to do it manually but if you're on 24H2 um, or maybe still stuck on 23H2 you should be seeing the uh, 25H2 arrive on your PC as Microsoft is now pushing it to everyone the uh, drivers that I talked about in the last couple of videos the AMD chipsets the Intel Bluetooth Wi-Fi driver updates all of that are optimized now for 25H2 which means if you don't see it by updating these drivers you might actually suddenly see 25H2 appear on your machine and uh, it is for now not a mandatory thing what's going to happen is going to show up it's going to say in your Windows updates well you know 25H2 feature updates available but there will be a uh, download and install button that you can click if you don't click it it's gonna stay there but at some point Microsoft is gonna force it on everybody so uh, don't be surprised that at some point um, especially next year uh, there will be a 25 h2 push uh, for your computer it is pretty much the same as 24 h2 so there isn't uh, really that much unique issues with 25H2 because they are pretty much the same issues as 24H2. Uh, but um, in my case, two machines on 25H2 have absolutely no problems. And the other ones on 24H2 also seem to be okay. But uh, be, uh, uh, be ready as this could appear on your machine soon. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.